Hey everyone, Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome back to Dr. Traoris' Challenge Coliseum for today's first ever Minecraft challenge. Now today's challenge is going to be called the Flying Villagers Challenge and involves what you can see down there. We've got some rocks in the arena, we've got some giant swimming pools, we also have a massive fence like dividing everything and it looks amazing from up here. We should invite some spectators sometimes time to us that would be absolutely amazing and we've got um, a nether portal which we've um, actually improved since last time and we've also got our certain areas of beacons down there so I'm going to explain the challenge when we get down below so um to us you're feeling excited about the challenge yeah. so how this is going to work is basically it's going to be me versus you and we are going to get a tally up of how many times we win the challenges so after this one one of us will be one above the other and and um, then we'll, we'll keep tallying up the totals through every single challenge video. How does that sound? Uh, Are you excited? Uh, then let's get straight to the challenge. Let's go, Taurus. Right then, guys. We are here and ready to start the Flying Villager Challenge. Taurus is here. He's ready to go. So I'm just going to quickly explain the rules. And then we're going to get down to see who can complete the flying villager challenge so as you can see right here we're in the the main part of the coliseum and there's a nether brick fence down the middle which is split into two sides so treoris you're going to be on this side right here on the right and i'm going to be on this side right here on the left and you can only stay in the red area so you must stay in here um the the chest counts as a part of the red area by the way so um yeah in the chest you will find a plasma gun so let me go over to my chest and um you can grab your gun as well so in here we have a plasma cannon and we're going to use this plasma cannon to shoot villagers into that pool of water over there so to the left of your little little red area you can see a summon villager button do you want to press that quickly do you want to press that and in the distance you should see look a villager head right over there and then what you're going to need to do is charge up your plasma cannon fire it and it will move the villager depending on how far you fire oh oh goodness he's, he's done it already <laughs> your thing already works but i think you you pummeled him into the ground a little bit there try again try again go have one more practice go there we go <laughs> He went over the wall. Oh, man. Perfect shot. Good job, Travis. Right then. So, basically, what's going to happen is we're going to go for, I think, two minutes. And then we're going to see who gets the most villagers inside the waterhole at the same time. And you can summon more than one villager at once as well, if you like. So, I'm going to go over to my little section over here. Make sure you've got your plasma gun ready. And are you ready, Travis? Shake your head if you're ready. Or nod your head if you're ready. Yep, he's ready. Three, two, one. Go, 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 go. So there's someone in the village. You can see him pop up just down there. I'm going to fire. Here we go. And he, he's, gone, <laughs> he's gone way off to the left. This is actually going to be a super hard challenge. So I'm going to summon in like three or four villagers at the same time. Let's go for four. And they should all be down the bottom there. Look at that. <laughs> now we're going to fire at them. Here we go. Oh, jeez. They've all gone the wrong way. Um, Oh, dear. And they've all died as well. This is good. <laughs> oh, man. Joris' side went crazy. So we've got two minutes. To try and get as many in as possible. But I think... Oh, no. Oh. Oh, that was so close. I need to get this person in. Oh, my goodness. It's going to be close. Let me try and aim this person in. Go on. Get right in there. No, it didn't reach them. Here we go. Oh. Oh, did it go in? No. It, oh. No. No. Oh, I died. <laughs> that was terrible right then. We've got... I think we've, we've already got a minute. I think we should go for three minutes instead. Because this is a lot harder than we thought it was going to be. That guy disappeared. Oh my goodness. Right then. You know what? Let's just summon as many villagers as possible. Did that summon in more than one? Yeah, it did. Let's summon in loads. And then just see how many we can summon in. Go on in. Go on in. Loads of villagers. Right. And how many have we got down there? An absolute ton. How is Choros getting on over there? Oh no. I didn't mean to do that. Oh dear. I didn't mean to do that. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to do it. I swear. No. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Charles, I'm sorry. Buddy, I'm really, really sorry. I didn't mean to do it. Oh, my goodness. This is, I got out my red zone. But that wasn't my fault. Right then. Let's fire these guys in. There we go. They've gone crazy. Did any of them land in? Oh, he just missed it. Oh, man. He just missed it. I mean, I think spamming them is the way to go. Because then they fly off in all different directions. Right then. We're going for three minutes. We're just coming up to two minutes and 40 seconds. One minute and 40 seconds, even. Right then. But loads of villagers here. There we go, there we go, they fly into the air. Where did they, did they fall? 
I don't even know if they... What are you doing? Oh my goodness, he's gone crazy. He's gone absolutely crazy with power and, and plasma guns. And that went way too far. This is the craziest challenge I've ever seen. Oh man, are you okay over there? Are you okay? I don't even know what's going on. Right, and let's spam some more villagers. We've got a total of 40 seconds left. Oh, jeez, this is going to go so wrong. Can we can we get these villagers in? Right then, let's sneak right to the edge here. And try it. Ready? Go! Oh, I think I've got one in. I think I've got one in. I can see it. And then, oh, man, those two almost went in. Oh, jeez, are they going to... I think it's going to be too far. Oh, almost. He's so close. He's so close. God, don't, don't move. Don't move. No! Oh, man, I thought he was going to... What is, what is Dreyoris doing? Dreyoris is absolutely spamming. Hey, hey, none of that. No, no, you can't be doing that. Get out of here. <laughs> oh, he went flying. Oh, jeez. Right, then we've got 10 seconds left. 10 seconds to try and get as many in as possible. Spam the button. Spam the button. Five seconds to go. Oh, jeez. Here we go. One last... <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, that was so close. Right, let's try this once more. Go on, villagers. Get in there. Get in there. Oh, and time is up. Trust time is up. Stop. Stop. <laughs> oh, man. So, Trust, how are you doing, buddy? Did you think you did well? Oh, no. Woof, that was close. <laughs> that was seriously close. So, Trust, did you think you did well? No, you didn't think you did well. So, who should we count first? Mine or yours, do you think? Uh. Uh, mine. Okay, let's go over here and see how many we got in. That challenge was actually really, really difficult. So, Trust, come over here, buddy. I'm going to go and count mine. So let's go over here. Let's go over here and see how many we got in. Oh! Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. Look how many are in here. I got three. I got three in total. Yes! Take a look and cry a little bit. Look at this. I got three in total. One of them is, like, by the side of the fence, but you just didn't want to be in the water a little bit longer. So you've got to beat three. Yeah. Let's go and check yours, shall we? Can we? I don't think we can get around. Oh, we can get around this side. Oh, jeez. Oh, That's a bit easier of a way to get in. Trust, you're a cheeky, cheeky bunk. All right, let's have a look at yours. You've got one. Yay, that means I win. Trust, where are you, buddy? Or is this you right here? Trust. Oh, it's you. Trust, <laughs> you landed in the pool. What are you doing in there? Oh, my goodness. You, got, you can't cheat like that. That's not fair. Get out of there. <laughs> oh, man. You're almost up in... Oh, geez. So, it looks like you got zero. I got three. GG, buddy. Well done. It's the taking park that counts, okay? <laughs> right, then. So, that means it's 1-0 for the first Dr. Treoris' Challenge Coliseum Challenge. The Flying Villagers Challenge. It looks like I won. So, it's 1-0 to me in the challenge series. How do you feel? <sighs> He feels upset. I think he feels very, very upset. So thank you so much for, for joining me, Treoris. That was awesome. And thank you guys for watching. If you are enjoying these challenges and would like to see more, then please do leave a big fat thumbs up. And I will see you guys in the next one. See, look, Treoris, you had loads of villagers around. You just didn't get them in the pool, I'm afraid. Try again. Try again. Try. Oh, jeez. He's very, very upset. Oh, no. He's very, very upset that he lost. He's killing them all. No, that's your cousin. He's, he's... Oh, no. Oh, no. They're all dropping like flies. You're mental. You're absolutely mental. So, yeah. Again, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy and would like to see some more challenges, then please do leave a big fat thumbs up. That would be awesome. And also, if this happens to be the first video that you've seen by me, then please do subscribe for daily gameplay videos. Again, thank you all for watching, and I will see you all next time. Goodbye!